Hola, I'm Yvette with MuyBuenoCookbook.com and co-author of the new cocktail book, Latin Twist. This summer, we're gonna be making some cocktails that are fresh, fun, flavorful, and light with the hashtag LocalCocktails. We're gonna be starting today with a delicious Reposado Paloma. It's made with fresh grapefruit juice and Reposado Tequila. And Paloma is Spanish for dove. This paloma is kind of like a margarita, but with some bubbles, super delicious. First, we wanna start off with some fresh grapefruit juice. And that's the key to a good paloma, and it's definitely healthier. So you wanna use about a quarter cup of red grapefruit juice. I like red because it's a little more sweeter than traditional grapefruit juice, and you get the pretty pink color. So you wanna start with your glass by rimming it with some lime and I have a plate of kosher salt here. I'm gonna just rim that just like a margarita. And I'm gonna add some ice. You wanna fill that up at least three quarters of the way. We got our grapefruit juice, now we got our lime. And I'm using just half a lime of freshly squeezed juice. And to sweeten up this drink, we're using agave nectar. You can use honey if you want. The key is try to avoid the sugar to keep it a little low calorie. This is a tablespoon of agave nectar. And we're gonna use some reposado tequila. And the key with any tequila is to be sure to look for a little sticker that says 100% agave. That's when you know it's a good tequila. Here's a fun fact, tequila helps lower blood sugar and has less sugar than any other spirit. So I'm gonna use two ounces. And for a mocktail version, just omit the tequila. It's gonna be just as delicious. And then we wanna shake, shake, shake. And you can use a cocktail shaker. I like using a mason jar. Smells really good. Now you just fill up your glass. And then we're gonna top it with some club soda. This is gonna give it the nice little bubbles. And there you have a refreshing Reposado Paloma. I'm gonna garnish this with a grapefruit and a lime. I've also made this in a pitcher so that I can be able to entertain my friends and not have to be shaking cocktails all night long. I hope you enjoyed this cocktail. And if you make this paloma, be sure to share it with the hashtag LocalCocktails. And for more recipes, for more recipes, be sure to look for the Latin Twist cocktail book. Until next time, salut.